downtown Fort Myers, where the Fort Myers Police Union, as well as the city of Fort Myers bargaining group, finally reached a tentative agreement when it comes to FMPD's contracts. Now, these negotiations have been going on for nearly 15 months, and now it seems like they're making a huge step in progress. It's been an uphill battle as both sides expressed to Fox 4 their frustration. A few weeks ago, the police union told Fox 4 it wasn't happy with the city's offer. But Mayor Kevin Anderson told me in a sit-down interview the city was going to make a generous offer. The city offered the union a $4.40 per hour pay increase for year one. As for year two, there will be a percentage increase based on how many years the officer has been with the force. Around 2 o'clock Monday afternoon, the city heard the counter from the union, and here's what the union wanted. The, for instance, the pension, um, there's a benefit that we'd like to have that officers are willing to give up uh, a savings account, essentially, that they have to help fund uh, better health insurance benefits for themselves. Um, and we just need to get the city uh, some new numbers to hopefully make that happen. Now, that was part of the counter that FMPD's union did present to the city. Afterwards, the city went upstairs and they considered it for about three hours. After that, they came downstairs to let everyone know that they didn't disagree, but they just have to work on the language. Now, once that language is cleared up, the next step for this is for the police union to vote on the new contracts. Now, the date for that has not been set yet, but Fox 4 will keep you updated as we learn more. From downtown Fort Myers, Brianna Brownlee, Fox 4.